a plumber by trade and uh, I started my own plumbing business in December 2007 and I was called out to a burst pipe which happens every year. Um, the guy couldn't turn his water off because he couldn't find the stopcock so he called me. I went to his house, I couldn't find it either. It was behind kitchen units so you could get your hands to it but you couldn't actually work on it. So uh, it took us about half an hour to an hour to actually find the stopcock eventually which was in his garage behind boxes. So I uh, turned the water off, helped him clean up a bit, repaired the pipe and uh, it was that night that I said to myself, how come there's nothing simple that you can just clamp onto the pipe to get you out of a tight spot? And then I had my eureka moment. Basically, um, if you've got a burst pipe, this is quite a big uh, burst in the pipe. It takes leaky fittings, um, pinholes and uh, accidental perforations made by a drill. But it just basically sits over the pipe. You put the latch on and clamp it over. And even if the pipe's clipped to the wall, you can fit it because it's, it's designed to be th slim enough to go onto a, a pipe which is actually still clipped to the wall. So it is quite easy to fit, you don't need any tools for it and it's very fast and you can also put it in on when uh, the water's still in full flow and uh, once it's on you can keep your heating and water on so that uh, you can basically keep going, you don't have to stop and uh, you know I mean you carry on living as they say. It can be reused, um, it depends, obviously, you, as soon as you, put, you fit it, you want to get the pipe fixed. You don't want to have it on for months on end because uh, that would flatten the seal. And when you're not using it, it's better to keep it open so that the seal can stay, like, it's, it can keep its shape. But uh, you don't want to be, like, closing it and then leaving it uh, closed for, like, however long it takes to get a burst pipe because then when you open it, the seal's not going to be exact, but not going to be the same. But uh, you can reuse it, it's absolutely fine. Um, development plans are we're making it for different sizes and for uh, bends, tees and other fittings. It's just very quick and it, it's, it's got a cavity which can accommodate large bursts and uh, pipe fittings. It's very quick, you can fit it with one hand. Uh, it's got good chemical and temperature resistance. Um, and it's just really simple. <laughs> it's just a really simple no-brainer that you can have in your toolbox and uh, fit it on in a second. So. Uh, if you did get a burst pipe situation, uh, instead of having like hundreds of pounds worth of damage, which can be caused in like no time at all, uh, you can put that on and just keep going. Because if you can imagine what a, uh, if you spill a pint of water on the floor, how much of a mess that makes. But one mains water pipe can lose um, a thousand kilos of water in one hour. That's like a ton of water. So that's how how destructive a burst pipe can be. But if you've got this. Um, you can fit it to copper and plastic pipework.